All right, so I wanted to uh, do a quick video real quick before I uh, get out of here and go and uh, get a workout in. <laughs> um, I, was, I was in a, uh, I'm, as some people probably know on my channel, I know I've talked about studying and all that, and I'm, uh, I was in, I'm in a sociology class. I was in a sociology class, and last night uh, the teacher starts talking about uh, hate speech. He starts talking about hate speech, and he goes in on that, and he talks about, uh, and and he talks about uh, 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 free speech. We're, we're talking about free speech. And then he gets to, to the point of hate speech and he talks about um, um, hate speech not being allowed. Anyway, as I can't remember verbatim, but we got in. I, I, so I raised my hand. And, and every once in a while, I'll put forth a little bit of conservatism in the class. And I don't do it. I, I kind of follow uh, the Ben Shapiro, what, what he talks about when he says... You don't really want to make a big scene. I, I I take his advice on that. You don't really want to make a big scene in class, but you do, you know, and, and, and potentially mess up your grade because the teacher can retaliate, especially when you start owning and making a point. But so I, I get to talking and I tell him, I was like, you know, free speech, I mean, or hate speech, isn't that just something that you just don't like? I say, what exactly is hate speech? And then I reference uh, this Dankula guy. I said over in Britain we have uh, um, in Britain we we have Count Dankula getting um, actually arrested for having his dog doing a Nazi salute. I know I did a video on this already. Of course, I don't agree with that. That's just absolutely crazy. So then he predicts, he, he he goes and says, uh, "Well, we're we're you're you're providing an American viewpoint." Says you're about you're providing a, an American viewpoint on a situation. I was like, well, I tell you what, look at Lauren Southern, how she was banned for having a sign that was talking about. Um, um, not, I'm pretty sure it wasn't just that, but the whole thing was saying Allah is gay, and they were upset, and they said that's hate speech. They called that hate speech and, and banned her from Britain permanently over this. So. Once again, oh, you're you're that that's once again that's that's uh that's uh the UK and you're you're providing an American perspective. And I told him I was like, look, I said that's still a Western country, just the same as we are, just the same. And I didn't even get into Canada with Bill Bill C sixteen and stuff like. That. I didn't even get into that. I don't want to. I don't want to get into that stuff just yet. I just want to, you know kind of just provide just a little bit. I don't I don't know how much more I'm going to do, but every class I'll, I'll say something, you know, just a little something or whatever, and actually have people come up to me after class and say, uh, I agree with you. It's that, it's that, it's that, it's, it's almost like that person coming out as gay or something uh, that people have said before. It's, all, it's like, it's like a, or not coming out gay, but uh, admitting they're gay. That's, that's how hard it is to, to, uh, to, say you agree with a conservative thought and uh, see because I didn't even get into the whole fact of uh, free speech is one of them to minority groups and supposedly oppressed a group uh, oppressed groups free speech is one of the most important things because then you know exactly where a person stands you know exactly where a person stands whenever they're allowed to say what they want to say. I want to know exactly what a person thinks. I don't want them to be racist in their minds. That's why you know people will call me a coon and a sellout and all this other stuff on Uncle Tom and blah blah blah. But the thing is, is that I want to know. I want the person to have freedom of speech, even if it is hate speech. That's still covered in freedom of speech. I want to know exactly where you're coming from. If you're a woman and you feel oppressed and there's guys, you guys should be able to say, I don't want women around, blah, blah, blah. So then you got something to point to and say, look, see, see, this is the reason we we need this for this group, this for this, whatever. So anyway, I thought y'all would find that interesting. I thought that was uh, absolutely amazing. And I can only imagine that the further I get, the more... The further I get uh, up uh, and further these having to take these social whatever, these humanities classes and all this other crap, the further I get, the more backlash I'm going to get. 
and that's fine. Like I said, I'm going to walk that tightrope to make sure that I still get a good grade, but then also kind of give them something to think about. I, once again, I've I've listened to their their argument. Why can't you listen to mine? But that's the way the left does. I don't want to listen. Yeah, that's the way the extremist of any side does. I don't want to hear your argument because, you know, feelings and all. So anyway, all right.